A long, long time ago I can still remember How that music used to make me smile We started singing Bye, bye, Miss American Pie Drove my Chevy to the levee But the levee was dry Good old boys were drinking whiskey and rice Singing this'll be the day that I die This'll be the day that I die Hi guys, this is how to play the classic sing-along uh, American Pie. This has a few chords in it, but they're not hard changes, and it's mainly the, the length of the song. Just a, a, It's a long sequence to learn if you want to memorise it, and a lot of lyrics if you want to memorise all the lyrics as well. But an absolute classic. We've got the chord sheet and the lyrics on the website. The link is in the description, so click through to that to see this uh, video and the lyrics underneath it, which is perfect to learn from. And let's get in for a close-up now on how to play American Pie. American Pie by Don McLean. What a song. And uh, the great thing about it, as well as it being a sing-along classic for you to play and sing along with your friends at barbecues and things like that, um, it also starts just with single strums of each chord that's going to be used later on with a lot faster strumming. So even if you're a total beginner, you can totally get around the, uh, the start of this song no problem. We s strum a G chord and uh, I'd go for the uh, all fingers G, so the Oasis G, like this, then to a normal D major chord, to a normal E minor chord. Now, when I'm normally performing this, I normally do that E minor chord with an up strum rather than a down strum, and that gives it a real sort of, just a different quality to it. And that goes with the intro lyrics. A long, long time ago. Just, it gives it a nice little flourish. On the I, we have an A minor. I can still remember is a C chord. Remember, E minor, remember the chords and lyric sheet, which you will need for this song, is in the link, top of the description, and you'll see the video and the lyric sheet underneath it, which is ideal. I think you can also print the lyrics and print the chord sheet for this particular song. A bit of a recap from there, from the G. A long, long time ago, I can still remember how that music, so that's an E minor, used to make me smile. Now on smile, you can just strum a D chord, just the once, that's totally fine as well. But what I uh, do to mimic the original is pick string four, string three, and then two. And then D, to norm, uh, D sus4 to a normal D, D sus2, normal D, to get that little melody to it. It just mimics the piano line in, in the original one, and uh, that will be in the tab part of uh, the, the description on my website. A recap from the top so we can see exactly where that happens. Three, four. A long, long time ago, I can still remember how that music used to make me smile. And then it's essentially exactly the same again. And I knew if I had my chance, I could make those C chord, people dance, E minor, and maybe this time a C chord, happy for a while. And you can do the same little. And then run into the next section, kind of the bridge, E minor to A minor. But February made me shiver, single strums again, same thing. With every paper I deliver And for bad news on the doorstep, it's bad news, it's a C Bad news, G, A minor 
bad news on the doorstep See, I couldn't take one more step That one more time Bad news on the doorstep I couldn't take one more step I can't remember if I cried is the same as the first verse until the last chord so I can't remember if I cried when I read about his widow bride just that D chord is different um, just at the end there after the A minor no E minor basically same thing again but something touched me deep inside the day is a C day D major the music died so let's have a go one more time through that again from the top and then we'll get into the rocking uh, chorus and, and the rest of the song this is an ideal warm-up for it three four a long long time ago I can still remember how that music used to make me smile one strum of a D or that's tabbed on the website remember and I knew if I had my chance I could make those people dance and maybe they'd be happy for a while but February made me shiver with every paper I deliver bad news on the doorstep I couldn't take one more step I can't remember if I cried when I read about his widowed bride but something touched me deep inside See? The day D The music G Died Demo of the chorus Bye bye Miss America I drove my Chevy to the levee But the levee was dry that would happen one more time again, same chords. So we have a G, a C add 9, and a G to a D. You may see other chord sheets show this as a G to a normal C. I run a beginner's channel and I just cannot really advise a beginner to go from a G chord to a C chord in this fashion um, at such speed. It's just much more logical and easier and sounds really great to go from a G to a C add 9 by moving your two fingers around here. I nicknamed this Oasis style chords. They are always, at least in this context, an option. You can go for the full C chord if you prefer it, if you want to give yourself a bit more of a workout. It's two strums of each chord. Bye, bye, Miss American Pie. Normal D chord there. That's three times. Let's have a playthrough together nice and slow. Two, three, four. Bye, bye, Miss American Pie. Drove my Chevy to the levee, but the levee was dry. And good old boys were drinking whiskey and rye. E minor. Singing, this will be the day that I die, is an A7. So this is a normal A chord, and the way I play it, play it one, two, three. Play it like this. Either way, the finger that's in the middle, Take it off, you need a gap there. Die. E minor again. This'll be the day that I die. That's when we start rocking. So everything there should be pretty straightforward. I mean, if you've struggled so far, focus on that part. Focus on the first minute of the song and try and get it so that you can play along to me in this video or the original record, the video for which is uh, embedded on my website. From here we have more standard strumming and um, kind of a bar of each chord and I'd recommend going for down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, up, down. What I call the most common strumming pattern ever because uh, it, it really is pretty much for these sort of campfire songs and for each chord written 
uh, unless it's at the end of a line. Occasionally at the end of a line, like the D chord or whatever, it can happen for two bars, but it's pretty much, if I give it a, a whirl first. Did you write the book of love and do you have faith in God above? If the Bible tells you so. You know, D chord at the end of the line, that's where you're expecting it to be a little bit longer till the lyrics start again. Everything else, a bar of each. So it's a G chord, A minor, C, A minor, E minor, two bars of D, down. Same again. Now do you believe in? This part of the verse is more similar to the intro. Now do you believe in rock and roll? Okay, so that's the same as the intro, but strum each chord twice. G, D, and E minor, down, down, up, up, down. Can music save your C chord? Model soul. Exactly the same courses, chords as in the intro, really. E minor. And can you teach me how to dance real slow? To a, to a D chord there. And uh, E minor. I do some single strums here to give it a bit of drama. Well, I know that you're in love with him Cause I saw you dancing in the gym Okay, same as in the bad news on the doorstep, you both kicked off your shoes. Man, I dig those rhythm and blues. I was a lonely teenage punk and buck. All this section is basically following the chords that we did originally. If it's quicker, if it's a G, G, D, so if it's less than a bar, you're on the down strums. If it's more than a bar, you're doing, or if it's a bar or more, down, down, up, up, down. Let me go from, from there again. Well, I know that you're in love with him, E minor. Well, I know that you're D major, love with him, E minor. Saw you dance in D in the gym, C, G, A minor. You both kicked off your shoes. Man, I dig those rhythm and blues I was a lonely teenage bronc and buck With a pink carnation and a pickup truck But I knew I was out of the good day The music died so at the end of that part, all pretty standard for what we've done so far, but the music died. G, D, C, C, G, and a D. Kind of starts the um, chorus chord sequence early. Day the music died. We started singing by, by this American pie. Okay, let's have a play along to that. The day the music died. We started singing bye bye in this American pie. Drove a Chevy to the levee, but the levee was dry. And good old boys were drinking whiskey and pie, singing, This will be the day that I die. This will be the day that I die. And you stay on that D chord um, when you're on it for more than a bar or two. Feel free to. Do some sus twos and sus fours as I show you in my beginners course, level four. Level four of my beginners course, we have D sus twos and D sus fours, and I show you exactly how to use them. Let me try and find it really, really quickly. And again, here we go. Sus twos and sus fours. There they all are. Written out for you all nice. That's my beginners course book in physical format available on the website. And that's basically everything. There's one more verse after that, which is exactly the same 
chords wise and playing wise as what we've just done. Um, I'll tell you what guys, I'm going to do a cover version of this song but I'm going to play it a little bit slower and that's going to be in the video after this one. So there'll be a link to it here where, we're, where there's a play along and it will be underneath all this on the website. I'll do a full play along of American Pie so that you guys can play along to me and um, see any little tricks that I, I may add while I'm doing it. Such a good f song, so much fun. Um, I will see you in that video and that's how to play American Pie. We started singing by, by this American Pie. I drove the Chevy to the levee.